Hello guys, hope you are doing great. Today we are going to see how to create breakbeat drum loop using the Logic Pro drummer and the Alchemy synth. We are going to sample our drum loops that we will create with uh, Logic Pro drummer into the Alchemy synth itself. And we are going to sample this out. We are going to use it with some vintage processing to create our own Break with drum loop. So let's get started. First of all, I'm going to create a drummer track. I'm gonna just make it four bars. Just gonna loop it. So I'm gonna bounce this one. Perfect. I'm just gonna take this on the side for now. I'm gonna create another one using the same drummer track. I'm just gonna change the drummer. I'm just gonna say it's RMB, new soul, change the drummer. I'm going to balance this as well. Okay. So basically these two drum loops are over here in our project library. Perfect. I'm just gonna do a new software in instrument. Instrument alchemy boom. Initialize preset. I'm gonna mute all of this. So basically, I'm going to import these two drum loops in my oscillators. Here I'm going to take import audio. I'm just gonna drop this here. Sampler import. As we see over here, it just got imported. For people who love sampling and synthesis, this is very interesting. Anyway, I'm gonna drop, I'm gonna take my second oscillator, boom, sampler, import, and I have two drum loops working together. Perfect. What happens over here that I want to change? my tempo because this is gonna get fast I'm gonna make it 150 but this is not gonna change we need to align our drums with our metronome so how can we go do this I'm just going to the first oscillator I'm just gonna close the second one 
and let's create a one bar loop on the C3 our base node So, as we hear, we need to align it with the patron. Yes, I like this. Just gonna close this one, take this one. We're gonna get there. Perfect. It's aligned. Just gonna close my metronome. So let's do some processing. I'm just gonna pan each one to a different side. So this one is going a bit here. This one is going a little bit there. And not only this, we're gonna use an LFO. So let me close this one so you can listen to the difference. As we can see, these are oscillating in different directions uh, with each one. So when this one is getting to the center, this one is getting to the left. And this one is getting to the right, this one is getting to the center. This creates some sort of interest in our loops.
just gonna pound this one I'm gonna mute this we're gonna so let's create an ultra beat drum sense I'm gonna take a techno 808 is just for creating this drum structure Bit crusher is gonna add some Compressor Don't forget to put your limiter We can also make this as mono. Nice. And then make it as a stereo using sample delay like when it was made in the 80s. You can listen to this one. Well, I can make even some stereo delay. Or even some tape delay. So guys, 
I hope you have liked this one. And keep the group running. So keep the magic running. Keep the logic running. <laughs> Cheers, guys.